Hey everyone, Silent here. Welcome back to another fish farm video. This one, very simple, very easy to build, one wide tileable, pretty much redstoneless, and also more or less silent. Um, yeah, so let's try this thing out right here. All you need to do is walk up to this right here, aim in about this area, and as you can see, you start AFK fishing pretty much immediately. And also, there is some drops in here. Look at that bone. That is uh, very, very fine. Anyway, so yeah, not much of a demonstration, not much to really show you since how it's so small. Alright, so to build this, you're going to need the contents of my hotbar. It's a very, very cheap fish farm. And of course, this does not need to be a block of iron unless you are rich. Anyway, so place down a chest, place a hopper going into the back of that chest, and then you're going to want slabs in all of these locations right here. Pop out that slab right there, and then place an iron door right there as well. Place in your water source that you're going to be fishing from, and then you want a note block right here. And that's pretty easy. Just crouch to place that. Place a tripwire hook on that. And of course, you need to be crouched to place tripwire hooks on the note block. Place a string right above your water there. And then you're going to want a block right there. And then a tripwire hook right there as well. And that is your entire fish farm completely done. Now, if we just get ourselves a fishing rod and basically just go up to it right here, you need to aim at pretty much this fourth line of pixels um, from the right. Um, so you see there's that black line of pixels right there, this brown line, and then there's the two checkered lines. So we're going to aim at the fourth one, and then go right below the water, and you should get caught right, right immediately, pretty much. <laughs> and let's see if we can catch something real quick. There we go, we caught ourselves a salmon. Very, very fine indeed. Um, if you want to get the aim a little bit more better, then you can put a block right there. Go right up into this corner, and uh, that'll make it a little bit easier for you to aim. And yeah, just basically aim right below the water and at this fourth line of pixels. And yeah, just hold it down. Um, if you want to know the proper ways to AFK, I have a video on that in the upper right right now, or there's a link to it in the description. Um, if your iron door hinge is not on the right side, it fits on the left side, then all you do is put a block right there, stand in this corner, and then aim at the fourth line of pixels. Pretty much just the opposite aim of that side. Anyway, that is very, very simple to build, very easy, and also if you want it to be silent, all you need to do is put a block or something above it, and that is really all there is to it. Um, of course, make sure that this water source right here has direct sky access going all the way up to the sky limit. Um, the reason being you want rain to be able to hit this water and that will give you a 40% increase in the amount of drops that you get when it's raining and when the water drops hit this water source. Um, so don't put any glass or anything above this. Uh, just have a hole going all the way up to sky limit and that'll make it so that you get more drops when it rains. Also, don't build it where it doesn't rain like the desert or the mesa. Also, if you are wondering how you tile this farm, um, basically build them directly next to each other and then you can have multiple people fishing so you can have like fishing competitions or whatever you want. Um, it's a little bit hard if you have uh, high sensitivity to get the aim correct. That's why I'm kind of like looking all over the place. But yeah, as you can see, all of these fish farms work um, perfectly fine. And also another good feature of this fish farm is that it catches the bobber um, first try like 90% of the time. So this is a very, very efficient fish farm. You're not going to be casting your rod like three, four times to get your, uh, to get it to catch. Also make sure you're not wearing mending armor when you have a mending fishing rod. Otherwise your fishing rod will eventually break. Anyway, that's going to do it for this simple little tutorial. Thank you for watching. Leave a like if you did enjoy. Subscribe if you are new. Share the video with your friends and also maybe even turn on notifications so that you get notified of my four new videos a week. And guys, thank you again for watching. I will see you in the next one. And then there was silence.